Hello and welcome to a little game I'd like to call Life is Strange. Life is indeed a very strange game. But you know, yeah. No, anyways, in all seriousness though, guys, Life is Strange is a super radical game. I've played it before, but I think it'd be fun to go through it, um, see how the first episode is. First episode, I think, will be in two parts. I think that's how we're gonna do it. Um, let me get my timer set up here. Um, and just because, like, the new game is coming out, which I really want to play, now that I have a job that actually pays money, I can now play that game and show you guys. So, assuming... Assuming this goes well, and assuming I get the money to get the rest of the episodes, I'm gonna have this be a let's play. I think it'll be fun. I don't know if I'll space it out. I might try to get them all out as quick as I can. I don't know yet. But, you know, I think it'll just be fun for uh, you guys and myself to play this very really relaxing game. Not me shouting at random shit. So, without further ado, let us start. So I only have the first episode because it's free. But, you know, whatever, right? Like, that's okay. It kind of makes sense, too, because, you know, I don't have money. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, alright. I'm gonna have to turn that down later. Thunder and lightning, very, very frightening. Me, Galileo, Galileo, okay. No more queen, it's time for the show, the, the game. Shut up! good enough for the master volume. Uh, sound effects volume could probably... Yeah, I think that's good. Right, let's go back to the game. Can I run, maybe? I don't know. Yeah, I'm going a little bit faster. God, guys, I really love this game. It's so beautiful. It's nice. It's just, you know, it's good. Yes, I figured that out. Thank you. Holy shit. Yeah, I agree. There's no place like home, NTM. Wizard of Odd reference, because there's a tornado. Wizard of Oz reference when there's a that tornado. Was so surreal. Oh shit. Film little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. Yeah, maybe. I'm These in class. Everything's cool. cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Aww. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't and white? fall asleep and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I don't know, it's okay. I can hear the class laughing at me now. Oh, I feel like okay. totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? Yeah, I'll take a selfie. And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. Uh, shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. Yeah. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. Yeah. And Max has a gift. Oh, thank you. I do. Of course, don't I? as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. 
Yeah. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. <clears throat> now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? All right, sure. Um, uh, you're asking me. You're asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this oh, or geez. not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Thank you. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. What a bitch. All right. That, Very good, That's not nice. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American I know the camera bag is battered, but still kicking. I agree. You can find out all about. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? This is, there's a lot of pages here. Uh, that's cool. Um, so yeah, while we're at a little break here, I have. So I'm not gonna read all this. If you guys want to uh, go figure it out yourself, the first episode's free. You can read it for yourself. Um, but there's just a lot of shit to look at. Um, I have played this game before, so I'm gonna shut up as much of the story as possible. Maybe talk about some philosophical shit. I don't know. And make a lot of jokes. But I'm not, I have played this before, um, so I know a lot of what's gonna happen. So I'm just gonna try and keep my mouth shut as much as possible. If I don't, then you guys can call me out on it. I beg of you to do so, so I can be careful. Alright, prologue. I don't care about that. In your textbook. Or even online. Oh. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. <laughs> Taylor, yeah. don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. You're a jerk. Why are you picking on poor little Max? I mean, Max is just trying to get by in high school. That's how it works. Uh... No, I don't want to look Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Yeah, I agree. Blackwell. Hey, Kate. How are you? Actually, let me look at the computer first. There'll be time for you, Kate, later. Looks like gotta... somebody was already working on this. Yeah. Cool. We gotta look at the thing now. It's all good. Uh, hi, Kate. Oh, let's look at the paper ball. Shut up. What's your name? Now I wish I wouldn't have read this. Purge. Damn. Okay. Just by participating. I should have read that actually. It said I. It said something like I enjoyed you in that porn video. Uh, Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Poor thing. Yeah, let's speak to her. Oh. Hi, Max. Hi, Kate. Aw, she's a cutie. All right. Um. I hope I didn't embarrass you. Kate, I hope I didn't embarrass you with my lame answer. It sucks to be dragged into the spotlight. Unless you're Victoria. Yeah, she's got she's... nothing on you, Max. Well, I should get going. Yeah, me too. Talk to you later. Bye, Kate. Sure. Love you. All right. Let's talk to these guys. Dick Wad and Dick Dude. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Yeah, maybe. That's how most mean girls are. Believe me, I've seen mean girls. Look. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. Probably because he's a fucking heartthrob. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. <laughs> I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Yeah, me neither. Uh... I didn't have any time. I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max. You're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you. I agree, it is. But life won't wait for you to play catch-up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? Yeah. But you do have a gift. Oh, thank you. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need <sighs> is the right. courage to share your gift with others. Thank you. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. I agree. Now, can I leave? All right, thank you very much. Can I look at the TV? I want to watch a show. Can I watch Rick Man, and Morty? he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. I agree. 
Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. People upstairs must be moving some chairs around. You didn't tell me how shit. cute I looked yet. I was about to. Like you Welcome to the real world. Yeah. yeah. Then I might send you a special picture. Because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. I'm not paying She plays it so sharp. I'm hip. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. I'm hip. I'm cool. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. Well. I hate that guy. Yeah. So Whoa, watch her mouth. Please don't swear on my profile. She's so fucking shy. Screw you. You're such a cutie, Max. Don't listen to them. That's pretty much how I feel in high school. I am in high school. I'm almost leaving. One more year. But enough about me. More about Max. Life is strange. Excuse me. Jeez. I don't want to look at these people. I kind of just want to mind my own business, you know? <coughs> Excuse me. Gross. American girl I wish October would last forever. I agree. It's a fun holiday. It looks like she's been gone for months. American yeah. Girls, I'd like to be part of the world around you. Driving a car by the seaside Watching the world from the bright side Let's go into the bathroom and see what's going on. Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. Yeah, same. <sighs> Alright, let's see what's going down here. Rachel is a bitch. Now who would bother to write that Rachel stuff? Amber. Oh, see, I don't know, because I, I can't judge. I've never seen her before. Uh, poster, whatever. Let's use the... Let's use this. Use the mirror. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go to. Oh, but that's not necessarily for you. It bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? I'm sure you're not. Let's use the sink. Let's get... Let's get washed up. We need to get washed up for a day at we gotta look good okay we gotta look our best we're going Just to relax look Stop at this photo yourself we gotta enter a contest you have a gift yeah a gift mr jefferson said so i wish i had a fuck gift it. no don't fuck it you make it an std or i sorry oh when a door closes a window opens or something like that i hate victoria chase me too wall me too Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Yeah, we don't. Hello, little butterfly. Uh, let's take a photo. Aw. Haha. <laughs> Goodbye, little butterfly friend. Oh, shit. A boy in the girl's bathroom? How mischievous. This is some work of Satan. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. Nathan, instead of Satan. Don't be scared. You own this school. Me I too. want it. I could blow it up. Yeah. You're the boss. I agree. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step ass would say. Oh my god. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing business. for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family. Not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. Oh I can God. tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am. Oh, oh. messing around with. Whoa. Pick? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. Same here, man, but I don't like to pull guns on people. more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? I don't, Get maybe. Get away from me, psycho! Ree, 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 ree. Get it, psycho? Haha. <laughs> it's funny. Jesus. Whoa. What the fuck? How? Everyone's looking at, at me, but no one's acknowledging anything. I was in anything. the bathroom. 
He shot that poor girl. Yeah. I held up my hand, and then I was back here. Yeah, he likely was. These pieces of time can frame. I agree. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. Aww. And if Victoria. I love you, Kate. Things, this is real. Now, oh, shit. Can you give me an example of a Man, photographer? I cannot believe this. Captured the human condition Aww. in black and white. Okay, if I'm Shit. crazy, I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? Yeah, maybe. Why Arvis? I did it. Hey, I actually did it. I did it. Perfectly captured human time machine. I guess you are, Max. I guess you are. Anybody? Bueller. Max, don't yeah. freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images of hopeless. When I took my selfie, like Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Kids call a selfie. A dumb, dumb word, word for, for a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful photographic, tradition. photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Thank you. I, I want to re-gift it though. This. As you all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation. So I can go back in time. Yeah, I guess. Expression. I don't what like your neck beard, Mr. Jefferson. I couldn't resist. It's a little what disgusting. Can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. I need to go to the bathroom Once quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured. Let's skip that. We don't need to. Uh. I feel sick. I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me after Lucy class. And I need time to save that girl. I agree. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Thank now you. Totally stuck in the retro zone. zone. Sad, Sad face. face. Sad face Victoria. emoji. What if I rewind again and give him the right answer? Okay. People's faces, okay. Making them extreme. Uh. Oh, shit. The Daguerrean process brought out. What the hell? What am I supposed to do? Well, Max, oh, since here we you've go. captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please? Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. Yeah, sure. It's the, uh, it's the Daguerrean process. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Thanks, Max. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I studied my best. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of Evan. Oh, thanks, Mr. Jefferson. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll follow right. with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. Yes. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Will do. Don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. Of course you're not. You're not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. We can be heroes, me and you. Yes, Victoria, you still have to do your homework. What if I talk to... Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody... Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future star... I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Yep. Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. I agree. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Yeah. Uh, but let's rewind. Because I guess... It 
It's time to be an everyday hero. Uh, okay. Excuse me. I don't quite know if I've got this stuff. Photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Uh, let's do John Lennon. I like John Lennon. I'm on Lennon. top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. John Lennon also said that he doesn't believe in Beatles. He just believes in himself. That makes sense. I mean, after all, he is the walrus. I could be the walrus, and it still wouldn't change the fact that I have to bum rides off people. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. I know there's no running in the hall, but, you know, I can't help it. I gotta get there in time. You know I don't tease. I hate that science class with those nerds. With those nerds. <laughs> okay, Max, retrace every step. But in all honesty, that's a Ferris Bueller reference. Holy shit, that's two Ferris Bueller references. Bueller. Then the butterfly flew in. Because and earlier he said Bueller, like the teacher in, B in Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Did the whole Bueller, Bueller Leave thing. them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. Oh you don't shit. Know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where did you get that? What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down. Tell me what to do. Wow, sir, it's happening. I need a hammer to break it open. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. For this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Yeah, haha, <laughs> we did it! Don't ever touch me again, freak! I agree, freak. Another shitty day. I got a text. Phone, that not now. Not I'm trying to record a video. This cannot be real. I can't I just be saw real. A girl get shot and then saved her. Yeah. What the fuck is going on? I don't know, Max, but it's pretty do awesome, isn't it? Freak out. Or do, I don't care. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I am sorry. You use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Hey, don't be Excuse sexist. For, what? for whatever you're up to, your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? God, why huh? is such an asshole? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Thank you, Mr. Principal. Or are you the prin No, you're the principal. Yeah, right. Shit. <laughs> I forgot. All right, let's talk to the principal. Hey, Mr. P, Mr. Oh, Mr. Wells, Mr. W. I like you Mr. P. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm, okay. I'm just a little worried about my future. Same. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? Yeah. You could always be upfront with me, Max. Well, maybe or not. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Maybe. Well, no. Max, talk to me. Okay, fine. Jeez. Uh. Hide the truth, maybe. I just got sick in class. Um, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? Oh, it's the God. Truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. Okay. There's nothing to hide. Fine. I got sick. Well, it happens, you know. There's that teen toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. Okay, You've only geez. been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. Oh, my God. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Okay, what Now the get hell? outside with class. Please. Can I... No, Can I... he does not buy that at all. Let's redo that I mean, whole just thing. I flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I could rewind and actually tell him the truth. You look a little stressed out. Uh, skip. Uh, we're gonna report Nathan this time. I thought hiding would be better. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. 
I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the Brandishing a bathroom. knife, it's Shia LaBeouf. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is a serious charge. Yeah, it is. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. Hey, no problem, Mr. That's Wells. It? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. All right, jeez. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Yeah, that's true. Okay, I've already rewinded and changed my story. I'm sticking with this one. I'm not sure which is better. Aw, oh, this is nice. I really love this game. It's a nice game. Would Nathan Prescott please come to the front office? Thank you. Alright. Jeez, and all those missing person posters. Uh, should we talk to people? There's not really a lot to say. Uh. Look. There's Hayden in his Vortex Club harem. He sure is living the dream. I think Hayden's cool, though. Hey, Hayden. There she is. The retro selfie master. That's me, all right. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell. Especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Yeah, Vortex Not Club. Not most. Uh. Uh. Yeah, we can talk Let's later. talk later, Hayden. Hi, Max. No, I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. Yeah, definitely. See, I can probably get some information by talking to people. Oh. What the hell? Hello? Flash drive. Same day. Meet you in the lot. Camera of I, I hope so. I hope so too. Warren? Uh. Oh man, I don't reply to any of his texts. Damn. That's unfortunate. Okay, that is Warren. Alright. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Yeah, let's do that. Press tab to open my journal. Next, 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 next. Okay. Oh, this is just recapping what's going on. Okay, that's just a recap. It's good. It's good. All right, let's go to the dorm room and check out what's good. We don't have time for wasting, wasting precious time. All right. Oh, what a quiet little area. Yeah. God, I love this game. What a nice I little game. I need to game. go to my room and return Warren's it Makes me drive. not be able to even wait for the new one. Oh. Hi, Max. Hi, Alyssa. Is that your name? Uh. How are you? How are you doing? Fantastic. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. Pretty soon I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. Yeah. I think you're better off reading chiclet. Good point. Now, if you'll excuse me. Cause they always, everyone always asks what you're doing, not never how you're doing. Oh, oh look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. I'm not a hoe. You're a hoe. You hoe. What a lame. Dirty hoe. <laughs> Even Mark, <laughs> Sorry. Mr. Jefferson, yeah. falls for your wave hipster bullshit. Well, maybe being hipsters. Okay, the Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. Well, I guess you're you got a... your meds filled. <laughs> oh, wow, you're a fucking bitch, aren't you? Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. Oh, I guess Meet so, you, you bitch. 
Oh, I'm wait. sorry, that's not nice. Oh, that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Get her bitch. Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Uh, yeah, I know it seems a little rushed, but I mean, I kind of already know what I'm supposed to do, so I just want to have a good story, you know? What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this! Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. On my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look yeah. great. I can't even chill on the steps. Yeah. Well, you know, maybe if you weren't such a diddly diddly dick... We could, like, you know. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. What if I were to. Wait a minute, if I already. If I already did the sprinklers, would they. Okay, no, I have to. Nice. What the hell? Why won't it let me work with the paint? No, ho ho! God damn it! Wait a minute. Oh, do I have to? Oh, I think I have to let Samuel do his thing first. That's weird. Yeah, okay. That's what I have to do. That's kind of lame. Grab that. Samuel is way too close. Oh, uh, what? Damn it. Samuel, buddy. What's your issue? All right. Let's tamper with the thing. Okay, let's see if this works. What the hell? There we go. Now it's all gonna work out. Everyone's happy. I'm happy. Hopefully you guys are happy. It's it's just fun. It's fun for everybody. Fun for the whole family. No way! Ha ha! Okay, yes. Oh, Samuel, sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo! Hey, don't be mean to Samuel. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It works. I'm a little stuffy today. Sorry. Don't buddy. mess with Max, that. bitches. Yeah, don't mess with Max, bitches. You fucking assholes. <laughs> oh man, she looks so sad and lonely sitting there alone. Yeah, that's what alone means. Uh, or lonely hey, means. Victoria. What do you want, Max? Oh man. You don't gotta be as bad as I her. I'm sorry. She learned that's her own awesome lesson. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there'll be another. Plus, my enemy's enemy is potentially well, a friend to me. you always seem to know how to pick the right outfit. I don't know who she's enemies with, but I, I mean, do some you talent. know, it is good to have someone who hates me on me. your side. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon esque. He's one of my heroes. Yeah. Thanks, Max. No problem. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. Hmm. Really? You deserve a better shot. 
Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck yourself -y. That was mean, but pretty funny. Mm, it was clever. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Thanks, Victoria. Also, pro tip for making the best of friends, Victoria stop calling everyone you. sluts. That helps, too. Sorry, Max, I just could not be bothered right now. I want to get by, make sure I can get a good chunk of this done in a certain amount of time. What time is it now? Let me check my timer. Hi, yeah, okay. I think it's a good place to stop here. Um, is there a way I can save this, or...? Oh well, if I can't save it here, then I'll just, you know... Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. Yeah, she probably will. Yeah, no, I'll just, uh... I'll just, uh... Play through a bit more and start the next video. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for joining me. Um, for, uh... This game. Life is Strange. It's pretty fun. I hope we can continue, and I uh, really hope to play the uh, next game. Hopefully, I'll buy the rest of this... This one here, and then we'll play the, uh... New one coming out soon. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for joining me for this episode, and I'll see all of you cool dudes in the next one. Buh bye bye